Hey, buddy. I could pick him up. You don't care that I just picked up your baby? Oh my god, he attacked me. Dude, that just that guy just came out of the Oh my god, they're violent. I'm gonna pick this one up too. I kidnap your babies, bitch. See ya! Hey guys, it's Jay Sway. Welcome back to the channel. And today we're gonna be playing for the very first time ever. Subnautica below zero. Round of applause. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. It's been a long time coming, but we're finally here, boys. We are finally here. If you're new to the channel and you missed my Subnautica playthrough, the link will be down in the description. But without further ado, let's go. This is the farthest I can take you on company space bucks, Robin. You sure you want this? The research is in everything. It is to me and Sam. I need to know what happened. The meteor storm. I can use it for cover from Altera's eyes. <sighs> Gonna miss you, Robin. I'll find my way back. Approaching 45, 46 feet. Surface temperature. Drop pond deployed. No! Yo, oh, are we good? Are we good? That intro was cold as fuck, bro. Enjoy your stay. Enjoy my stay. Holy shit. What is happening right now? Oh my god. Bro, do I need to like do anything? Those can't hit me, right? Holy crap. Yo, we're in it. Where are we? It's, we, oh my gosh. Oh, what's that? It's a nutrient block. Thank you very much. I need that. Oh, we got a whole bunch of goodies around here. Thank you. New blueprint synthesized. Okay. Oh, look at this PDA layout. It's new. Holy crap. Okay. Um. Oh God. Do I want to read through all this? All right. Let's uh, let's get out of here. I want to go towards um, whatever that is. Let's go towards that. It's like 300 meters away. Hello. Holy smokes! That did not go as planned. I should find a way into the water and get to the drop pod. Okay, that's what we should do. What is happening right now? Why is it looking at me? Hello? That's so weird. That's kind of creepy. I'm not going to lie. It's like radiating something. I don't really know what. When I get close, it... Oh, okay. It feels like it's like warm. You know what I mean? I feel like... It feels like a heater. Is that what it's doing? I don't know. We'll figure that out. It's not like hostile or anything. It's just really creepy. It's kind of creeping me out a little bit. Okay. Bro, where are we right now? We're like on this like icy region that we never got to see in the last game. I think I'm going in a, in a circle here. That's so cool. Yeah, what if I get too close? Anything? Nothing. All right. Oh my God. Yeah, it burns. It's definitely warm. It burns. Let's not get too close. Um, I'm looking down at my food meter. I am hungry already. Oh, I got a nutrient block, duh. Let me go ahead and pop one of those. Thank you very much. What's um? Oh, dude. So in the last game, that meter around, you know, that's counting down right now. 82, 81, blah, blah, blah. That's where my O2 was last time. Now it looks like temperature. Right? There's a thermometer icon there and it's dropping. So let me go back. I can put two and two together. All right? I'm smart. If I go back here, it goes back up. Atta boy. All right. So we have to worry about our uh, temperature apparently in this game. The OT meter is down there as well. But of course, we don't have to worry about that right now because we're sucking in some good old O2. Some good old oxygen. This water looks different. Is it just me or is it different? It looks clear. This is Miami water right here. That's not Florida water. Do we hop in? I bet it's going to be freezing cold. No? Oh, okay. I thought we would have to. I thought it'd be like super cold or something like that. Why am I holding my flare still? 
Okay, look at- wow! This looks really- this looks really different. Oh my gosh. Who fish? Okay, this must be edible. Yes, it is. Um, cool. So we got a hoop fish. What else we got going on over here? I like, look, they definitely, obviously, I know there's been like a few years between the first Subnautica and this Oxygen. game. Clearly a big graphical update. And I am here for it. It looks, I thought that was a, I don't know what I thought that was. Hey! What's up, guys? Hey, what's up, man? Oh, that is so adorable. It's a baby penguin. Oh my god, they look creepy though. They look creepy. They're not gonna like turn into some fucking demons, are they? Hey, buddy. I could pick him up. You don't care that I just picked up your baby? Oh my god, he attacked me. Dude, that just, that guy just came out of the. Oh my god, they're violent. I'm gonna pick this one up too. I kidnap your babies, bitch. See ya. All right. Um, what can I do with the babies? Are they, um,. I guess I can maybe give them as a pet, maybe? <laughs> I'm not sure. <gasps> a bladder fish! Hey, what's up, bro? I know you! I know you, you look different. New creature but discovered. I know what you are. Oh my god. Those guys are probably really deadly underwater. Um, why is it not opening up? Let's see, I'm trying to get to the data bank. Um, da da da, okay. Oxygen. Oh my gosh. Oh, dude, I need to set it so that I can, um, here. I need to set it so that way I can pause a game when I'm in my PDA. I forgot to do that. I don't really... Accessibility? PDA pause. There we go. Alright, now we should be good. That's definitely a big must. Yo, this looks amazing. I can't tell what's different about it, but it looks busier. If that makes any sense. It looks busier than um, the first Somnotica game. Like, there's a lot more going on in a smaller area. You know? That might be... Um, that might be in my head. I don't know. Okay, is this where I'm supposed to be? What do I do now? Got some solar, solar, solar panels on it. Okay, good. We got a uh, fabricator. Let's go ahead and cook this fish up real quick. Um, I got a hoop fish. I'm going to taste uh, this hoop fish for the very first time. It's a delicacy. Let's grab some water. There we go. All right. So uh, what now? Storage. What do we have in here? Anything? Nothing. Um, should I store anything in here? No. Well, Sam, I guess I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. Okay. So we're looking for a radio tower. Voice log. Um, I have to read it. I have, I like, I have really bad listening skills, so they can give me, they can tell me what to do all they want. I gotta read it for myself. Well, Sam, I guess I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. So we're looking for a radio tower, but in the meantime, we're gonna start crafting some tools. Um, not a deployable. Tools. Okay, we're definitely gonna need a scanner. Um, I'm gonna pin that. Can I? Did it pin? It didn't really pin, did it? Oh, wait. Wrong button. All right, so I'm going to pin that. I also need to figure out how to make a battery here. Um, it's probably the same as the first game. No, it's not. It's different. A ribbon plant and copper. So instead of a uh, instead of the mushrooms, we have to find a ribbon plant. And of course, we got to find Tantanium as well. Okay, so where are we? What are we doing? Uh, bullseye mushroom. I need to find a ribbon plant. What does that look like? It's yellow. A ribbon plant. That looks like a. That looks like. Oh well, no, that's a kelp forest area. Um, but it's the closest thing I can see to a ribbon plant. So we're gonna go here anyway, and maybe we learn something new. What's this down here? This looks like ribbon plant. Yes, it is. Plants contain electrolytic materials that can be used in energy storage. She sounds like she has an accent. I don't know. Lead. I want to grab some more ribbon plants. I don't know if I'm gonna need any more. I'm just gonna grab stuff that I feel like are probably that looks not safe. It looks like the tiger plant in the previous game. Oxygen. Oh no, you don't. Okay, what's this? I was a little nervous about dropping into an unknown area, but luckily this biome seems to have an abundance of minerals I can use for tools and upgrades. Okay. I didn't want another situation like Byzantos Five. 
When Xenoworks dropped me off, there were barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. Rope? What can I use rope for in this? Um, okay, let's see if we can craft anything here. Uh, battery, let's do that. And we got our scanner. Thank you. So I definitely, um, I'm gonna need a knife as well. Alright, I... I have a scanner. Scanner, check. Okay. In goes the battery and titanium. Out comes the scanner. Every xenobiologist's favorite tool. This planet has some fascinating flora and fauna, and I can't wait to learn about them. This will also give me access to a greater tool set. I'm assuming Altera left behind tech that I can scan for blueprints. That should make surviving and exploring out here a bit easier. Don't worry, Sam. I haven't forgotten I'm here for you. But it can't hurt to do a little research on the side, right? I know you would have done the same. I will find out what happened to you. I promise. Okay, we gotta find Sam. Was that right? Did I get to... I, I, again, like, she was speaking and I was barely listening. Coral Bridge? Oxygen. Okay, this is, this is gonna be really annoying. This is gonna be really annoying. Get up there. As soon as I can make... Ugh. As soon as I can make a, uh, an O2 tank, I need to do that. But we're gonna go back here first. I don't see any, uh, cluster seeds anywhere. Do you guys see it? I don't see any. I don't see any cluster seeds. These are definitely different than the, uh, the creep vines in the other game. Oh, fuck. There's like a, I see like a little hole down there. With more creep vines. I'm gonna see if there are cluster seeds down there. I just needed to grab some air real quick. I'm gonna go straight down there. I bet you I can find some seeds down there. Oh, I can scan this now. Sea glide fragment. Thank you very much. Um, ew, what is that? Oh, we're. Oh, shit. This is giving me oxygen. Nice. Let's scan it. Thank you very much. We're gonna scan the frick out of everything. How long do I have to wait for another one of those to replenish? I don't know what I'm... Sea monkey nest? What the hell's a sea monkey? Oh my god! Oh, I know what that sound is. I know what that sound is. Help! Fuck you. My oxygen, please give me another oxygen. one. Woo! <laughs> I am not paying attention to my oxygen at all. Um, anything? What is that? That's a hoop fish. Okay, I don't see any, like, clusters down here. Oh, I got another fragment. That's two out of three. I need one more. And I think I know where that one more is. Oh, God. Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. Damn it. Did I not scan that Oxygen. before? Oh, let's go. Let's go. Get some air. Swim faster. I feel like she swims a lot slower than the other guy. Ugh. Well, then again, I had, like, upgraded fins, so... Oh, there they are. There they are. I need one of those. I need two of those, or maybe three of those. I'm not sure. Let's scan it first. Thank you very... Mm, one more? Much. There we go. All right, I'm going to take this back to... Uh... Damn it. New blueprint synthesized. Oxygen. Let's get up here. All right, so with this, I can make silicone rubber, which means I can now make a, uh, well, I need more titanium, but I'll be able to make a knife and fin so I can swim a little faster, hopefully. Twisted Mandrake. So we got to keep our eyes peeled out for uh, some limestone here so we can get some titanium. Uh, I think, is this limestone? That's a big rock. Got it. Okay. So that should be good for uh, the knife. So let's go ahead and take care of that real quick. Thank you very- Ooh, yeah, that looks good. Look at that. Nice. Uh, what else? Um, fins, let's do that as well. So we can swim a little faster. Okay, now we can get some uh, fiber mesh. And to do that, to craft that, I need samples. Now I can grab samples at least. I need to grab two of them. And what else do I need? Um, two titanium. Okay, let's go do that. Let's go grab some samples real quick. And some more titanium. Okay, I'm definitely swimming faster, right? Yeah, I'm definitely swimming faster. I think a good 15% copper. 
Okay, we're gonna need more than that. Okay. One swipe, two swipe. New blueprint synthesized. Thank you very much. So we got that. Now I can make some uh, fiber mesh. Don't forget, we gotta like scan stuff. Oh, you know what I need to do? I actually, I'm gonna make two of them. Oxygen. Two tanks. Um, so I'm gonna need like four titanium. Here's the last uh, sea glide fragment. So we got that taken care of. Now we can craft that, which is awesome. Which also means if I scan this, I'll get some titanium. What do you know? So we need two more though. Let's grab this guy here. That's one. One more. Do I see one right here? Let me scan it first. I feel like that's something uh, I did uh, not a very good job of in the last game. Oxygen. I didn't scan as much as I could have, you know? There got to a point where I just didn't scan anything. But I want to do better with this game. I want to scan more. I want to take my time, you know? No need to uh, rush anything. I definitely felt sad for finishing the first Subnautica game. Like, I already miss it, you know? So I'm kind of... I definitely want to take my time with this. I don't want to leave this world anytime soon. And to be honest, I'm not done with it. Listen, that's some Nautica playthrough, and again, link down in the description if you want to check it out. I'm not done with that game, okay? That whole playthrough was just a tutorial. I'm gonna hop back in it, we're gonna go on like permadeath, creative mode, whatever we need to, but I am not done with that game. That was just the first playthrough. We're gonna play that sucker all the way up until some Nautica 3. Okay, mark my words. Um, I think I came back prematurely, right? What else did I need? Fiber mesh? Do I have enough titanium? I think I do. What was I crafting? Oh, the tanks. I wanted to make two of those. Here we go. Do I get a free... Oh. Blueprints to your data bank. Okay. The standard oxygen tank can be upgraded for deluxe and VIP breathing. Okay, there's so much more we need to, uh, we need to get. Okay, so is there like a med kit thingy in here? Because I need a med kit. I might have to craft what it looks like because I don't see anything in here. There was nothing in the uh, storage. Um, I need to go get some more uh, creep. Okay, I need to focus up a little bit. All these pins are making me really nervous. Um, but I need to craft another one of these. Craft a first aid kit. Um, a repair tool. And a sea glide. Okay, I feel like that's a good start. That would be a great start. Um, so let's go back over here. And two samples make one fiber mesh, so I need to grab, like, a few more than that. Let's do that. Let's grab a couple of these, right? Like, how many do I need then? So two make one, that's for the tank, and then I needed another fiber mesh for the med kit, got it. So that should cover that. Um, what else? The repair tool, I'm gonna need more titanium. I need another uh, cluster, I think. Or well, I've already got a silicone rubber on me. I've got a spare one. Yeah, so we don't have to worry about that. That looks like crystalline uh, sulfur, doesn't it? Where's the sea glide? Um, not the sea glide, the repair tool. Where is that? Yeah, crystalline sulfur. Okay, we had a hard time finding that in the Lost River. So where do I find that here? Am I gonna find it in one of these caves? I thought maybe the logic behind crystalline sulfur is that you can find it in like really hot areas like lava zones or whatever. There might be one around here somewhere. I might not find it, honestly. I had a hard enough time finding it in the last game. Something tells me I'm going to have a hard time finding it here too. Maybe in one of these caves, like here. This feels like... Okay, we've got a PDA. Contact has been lost with the Aurora some 18 months into its journey to install a phase gate in... Oh, one kilo... Bro, I th when I read one kilometer, I my mind was thinking much, much smaller. They were talking about the Aurora ship, the actual ship itself. Yeah. Anyway, contact has been lost with the Aurora some 18 months into its journey to install a phase gate in the Ariarara arm. Report inside resources. Altera launched the Aurora to much fanfare almost two years ago and recently announced the ship had arrived in the destination solar system. The Aurora has reportedly now missed more than one routine check-in. Damn. Uh, Axe for, for comment, a spokesperson for Altera said, communication with the ships outside of the phase gate 
network can take weeks or months in ordinary circumstances and is commonly interrupted. The Aurora was in good shape and ahead of schedule the last time they checked in. We have no reason to think anything has changed. Nonetheless, our sources emphasize that Altera cannot yet explain the loss of contact, and given the exceptional, exceptional value of the ship and its mission, they are taking every possible measure to reestablish contact. Shareholders will be watching closely. Uh, keen readers will remember, however, that Altera's network of directors have a history of leaking scare stories like this to the press, only for the transgov to rebound with positive news against the odds. Directors, shareholdings, and dealings are, of course, not public information. Oh yeah, we know exactly what happened to the Aurora. Exactly what happened. Oh, we got a mobile vehicle bay. I wonder if we can make a Cyclops and all that in this game as well. I did see some pictures of the game before. So I'm like, I'm not totally 100% brand new to it. But I did see like a, like a... Okay, bro, chill. I did see like a, um, a, like a truck. Did I just drop my... No, I didn't. Like a truck, like you can uh, craft like a truck or something like that. Something like a Cyclops, but it was a truck. So I don't know if that's bigger than a Cyclops or smaller or whatever, or if we're gonna like hold a lot more, if it has a lot more storage space or something like that, but I definitely want to check that out. What is that? Is that an eyeball? Oh no, it's a grab trap. We definitely want that. One of two, thank goodness. If I can find the other one, that would be fantastic. I think I'm out of like, oh, that's silver. I think I'm out of space. I'm going to go back and craft what I can. Like that med kit. And, um, and the other oxygen tank. Because I'm still having to worry about oxygen right now. And it's kind of rather annoying. Let's craft another O2 tank. As backup. Awesome. And then, what else do we need? That med kit for sure. But where is it? Where is the med kit? Not there. Bro, where's the medkit? How do I craft one? Bro, what? Am I just not, like, seeing it? I'm gonna have to... Oh, right here. Oh, fiber mesh? Well, duh. That's what it says. <laughs> I just couldn't find it on the, uh, the fabricator. Alright, but, uh, here we go. Okay, we're making really good progress right now. Boom. Alright, so now we need to go find the, uh, the sulfur. But we can also keep an eye out for... We need to craft that uh, fucking sea glide as well. So for that, I need to... Um, can I actually craft... What do I need to craft a... Uh, let's go ahead and craft that battery. Um, lubricant, if we can. The copper wire. I think I'm going to need one more copper for that. I think I have one on me. I'm not totally sure. I need to double check. Um, where is it? It should be under electronics, right? Yeah, I need two. I don't think I have one on me. I've got zero. Yeah. Let's go ahead and use that real quick. And no copper. Let's go find ourselves some copper. Oh, what is that? What do we have here? That's new. A Galena? Jelena? Galena? Not really sure how to pronounce it. I'm going to go back to... Oh, this looks like a uh, sandstone. No, it's not. So many new outcrops. Silver. Don't mind if I do. Should I... Oh, Warning. fuck. 30 seconds of oxygen oh my remaining. god. I was like, already? That kind of startled me. I'm going to swim a little bit further out. And see if I can find any like little caves or anything like that. Why not, right? Let's just get out there. Get some air while we're at it. Oxygen. Thank you very much. Yeah, I bet you there's tons of, uh, tons of, uh, what am I looking for? Copper down here. I might need to grab these guys while I'm at it. Like this guy right there. Okay. Let's not grab that right now. Uh, more limestone. There's copper. Sea glide fragment. That's going to give me some more titanium. Thank you. Got a lot of titanium now. Silver. So did I just get copper out of the uh, the limestone? Is that new? Titanium. Oh, lead. Let's grab that real quick. What else we got going on here? Let's go down here. Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen. Wait, do I? Is it okay? My stand. My O2 tank is not full. It's a good thing I checked that because I would have just assumed that it was. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this real quick. 
Boom. All right. Let's see if we can find anything down here. Definitely hope I find some uh, sulfur, but you never know. Is that table coral or whatever it's called? Yes, it is. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Damn, already? Let's just grab that. That looks like salt. Um, more titanium. Narrow leaf. I don't know what that is, but we'll read up on it later. This looks like a fragment. Yeah, the sea truck. There it is. Yeah. One of three. Thirty seconds of oxygen. Dude, I thought I went up. I swear to. Oh my gosh. I thought I swam to the surface to. Uh, I thought about swimming to the surface to fill up my O2 tank, my spare one, but I didn't. Oxygen. So I almost got myself killed again. Let's go for some air real quick. Then when we go back down, I don't think we're going to have time to find the uh, sulfur and the copper. So let's do, um, let's just go for copper. That should be the easiest thing. We only need one more of those and then we'll call it a day for now. Let me go ahead and switch these out so I can not have to worry about it again. Is it good to go? All right, let's go. Let's go. Okay, I'm going to scan those later. I'm wondering, if I swim to the bottom of this, am I going to find anything interesting? And maybe I shouldn't swim all the way down because I don't have... Like, I don't really move very quickly right now. What is this? Oh, PDA? Fred, great to see you. Come on in. You don't mind if I record this, do you? Uh, am I in trouble? <laughs> no. You not know, the copper! Just a fanatic Let's go back. details. And my memory's not what it used to be. <laughs> I know what that's like. <laughs> yes. Is that why you've been running so many personal errands for your colleagues? We asked you to limit them. Uh, so I am in trouble. That's not how I want you to look at it. Here's what I see. You're a team player. You want to get the job done. I think I have a pretty good record there. You want people to like you. Has anyone complained? Fred, the trouble is, not everyone is as reliable as you are. Sometimes people need help being where they need to be and concentrating on their work. All the trips were work-related. It appears you transported tech for Lil rather far out from her base. Lil needed to go deep and she needed a sea truck. Her work is currently on surface installations. She shouldn't be anywhere near the water. I, uh, well, I... No more favors to friends, agreed? Yes, sir. <laughs> ah, I keep telling you. Call me Manu. <laughs> Okay, that Easy was flight is a personal uh, transportation device used for high speed free diving. Contains a built in light and map. Cool, so we finally have the sea glide. Um that interaction between uh Emmanuel and first of all, when did everyone become American? I noticed that. Um I'm not complaining. Pretty cool. Represent. So who's Lil is what I want to know, because that that name keeps popping up. Lil. And apparently, uh, Fred was helping Lil out for some reason. I'm not really sure. So Lil's definitely got something planned. And I feel like that might tie into the story somehow in this game. So we're going to find that out. We're going to figure that out. And see if... um, Yeah, I want to know who Lil is. Like Lil, Lily? Lily? Liliana? Who knows? Anyway, guys. That's it for now. I am definitely... I'm excited to play this game. I hope you guys are excited to watch me play this game. Um, if watching this makes you excited to play the game again yourself, like, that's what I'm here for. Anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Until then, stay blessed. Peace.